Good morning. Um, I brought you with me today. This is um, a day in the life of Julie when she's in town. Um, I have already went and got my coffee this morning. You missed that part of my day. Um, but I still have it here. I'm drinking it. And um, anyway, I'm about to get me some time and prayer. What I do, um, one of the things I do to cope with being in such small space with these boys and uh, with Johnny is I slip away early in the morning. I, everybody always jokes me about Dunkin' Donuts, but to me, it is completely worth the $2.56 um, to be able to get away and plus it gives me, um, I get a really tasty coffee. Time alone with God is important to me every day and the, just the, I got spoiled to be honest with you. Uh, when we lived in the house, the boys would sleep till at least nine o'clock and I'd get up at six. So I'd have about three hours of me time and God time. It was kind of a culture shock, kind of a shock to my my system not to have that anymore. So this is what I do. I get up early and I go to the Dunkin' Donuts and then I either park at the Dunkin' Donuts or today I've got to be at Hobby Lobby for, I've got to get a couple of things at the Hobby Lobby. So I just came on and parked here and I'm going to read and pray and and have my time with God and by the way if you have a prayer request um, you can post it down in the comments below and I will be more than happy to pray for you in my time in the mornings um, and add you to our list so anyway I'm going to get me some spiritual food and I'll catch you in a little bit all right, I'm all finished with my coffee. Okay, I am finished with my Bible study this morning. Um, of course, we're supposed to pray without ceasing and acknowledge God in all our ways today. But I am fixing to walk into the Hobby Lobby. And, um, we'll see you. Today's the day the Lord has made. This is the this is the um, the book that I have been studying and reading. It is absolutely awesome. I highly recommend it. It gives the Psalms from a passionate standpoint. Um, it's just really, really good. I'm such a nerd. <laughs> I got to the Hobby Lobby and they're not open yet. Who would have thought that nothing opens till nine? <laughs> I am seriously such a nerd and an early bird. I went over to the Goodwill and they don't open till nine. So there you have it. I should have just spent like way more time in prayer and in the Word this morning. So I'm going to walk back to the van and spend a few more minutes with God. A few more minutes reading and praying. So, there we have it. I'm going to try this a second time. Um... I see other people going in, so maybe they'll let me in.
Hobby Lobby and now I'm headed to do a couple more errands. Um, I need to go by the bank, I need to go by Dollar General, and then back to do school with John. So what are y'all doing? We are creating a t-shirt um, out of paint. Awesome. Yes. It doesn't even say. It's going it to says say, love right now. It's going to say, love. I love my wife. Yeah, it's crooked, but it's going to be my shirt, so, you know. <laughs> We have always wanted to sell shirts that say, I love my wife and I love my husband. And the reason why is because God's healed our marriage and we want to promote marriage and promote um, unions between right. husband and wife. So John's doing the painting and I'm doing the stamping. And I'm doing the looking. He's doing the looking and Nathan's doing the recording. <laughs> Here's the finished product before it's air dried. It's got an air dry nail. Yep, now I can tell everybody that she made me the shirt. <laughs> I don't think it looks too bad. I think it'll be awesome. Awesome, awesome. Yep, now it's got to air dry for 24 hours and then we'll heat set it with a dry iron. Hey, I said that I would take you um, and let you follow me throughout the day. This is the day, a day in the life of Julie hope it's not too boring right now I, I am overseeing school with John he is um, busy doing his schoolwork this morning and that's what we do and we homeschool and we chose to do that many many years ago and it's a choice that I'm real happy with and glad that we've done and um, just so thankful for the freedom to do it this is John, hard at work. He's doing his grammar right now. And uh, this is just our mundane daily routine. And he's studying in history. He's studying American history. And we are reading Uncle Tom's Cabin right now. And we're also watching on, um, on Netflix. YouTube. We, on oh sorry we're watching on youtube what are we watching ken burns civil war history yep yep we're using that as a supplement it's really good i recommend it highly so far today i have went and spent time with god ran some errands had my coffee um started a new project for our group um to sell on our product table um, I have been overseeing homeschooling. I am, I've made a couple of phone calls, um, for our Saturday Gospel, um, TV show. And I have paid a couple bills. Eh, paid a couple bills. And now I'm working on uploading a video to YouTube. And I, at the same time, I'm working on um, our newsletter for this month, our May newsletter that's going to go out to our subscribers. By the way, if you are not on our email list, um, go to our website and you can sign up there to get the latest of our concerts and news and things like that. It's www.theparsonsredeemed.com kind of got behind in my vlogging today me and Johnny got to go run an errand um, got kind of busy with stuff and, and lost track of the day in the life of Julie <laughs> so 
<laughs> There's my babe. <laughs> so now we're headed to run a couple of errands. We're uh, yep. gonna come back and hopefully practice. <laughs> I'm fixing a quench a craving I've had for a few days. <laughs> I was going to show them the sign, did you? I did. I don't know if it's showing up. We're in the drive-thru. We had to come to Forest Park to pick up um, a payment. And I've been craving a slaw dog. So, mm, yummy. And onion rings. Ever since the Bristos mentioned onion rings, I've been craving onion rings. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so. onion rings. Yeah, they're they're singing at the Vidalia. Oh, that's right. Vidalia yeah, Festival. I, I talked to Scott this morning and yeah. he told me about that. And so it made he me said, crave onion rings. He said, "I'm gonna put your name in the hat down there." Yeah, I yeah, said, okay. absolutely. absolutely, absolutely. I was wondering how they got in on that. I looked it up. You know how I am. Yeah. I'm always doing my research. Well, you got so. to now, day and time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You just waited for something to happen. Nothing ever would. No, that's the way it is with anything. You wait. Right. You wait on something to happen. Sit around and wait. Nothing's gonna happen. We had that question asked to us a while back, a couple years ago. So, what are you doing toward it? Ever yeah. since that question was asked, yeah. I've been doing, doing. Oh boy, asked the right question mm -hmm. that day, I think. Yeah, because I've, <clears throat> I've kind of took it and run with it. I probably worked about four hours at least on PR and um, CD stuff and newsletter. By the way, we'll have our newsletter out because I worked on it today. And um, we'll have that out. It'll be sent out on the first or actually no it'll be sent out on the 28th which is friday yeah. so to get in the know you need to go to our website and subscribe to our newsletter put your name in there your email <laughs>